Welcome to this screencast. I'm Mr. Gauvin and I'm going to walk you through drawing a break even chart for the GCSE in business. To draw a chart, you need to know the fixed cost, the variable cost per unit, the price per unit. From these numbers, you will calculate a total cost at a given quantity and a total revenue at a given quantity. You will place these on a graph made of two axes. The horizontal one is a number of units. In this example, it's by thousands of units. The vertical graph is money or pound uh, in the UK. The first thing to draw on your graph is your line for the fixed cost. So you just look on the vertical axis for money you place uh, the value of your fixed cost and you draw a straight horizontal line because the fixed cost never change as the number of units sold changes. Next, we are going to draw the total cost. So at a given number of units sold, here we've got 10,000 units sold. And for 10,000 of units sold, we make 35,000, it cost us, sorry, 35,000 pound. So I'm going to place this point on my graph. And now I've got two points with which to draw my total cost. How come? Well, when you sell zero items, you still have got to pay your fixed cost. So I know my first point, which is on the vertical axis, and I've just placed the second point in the chart. Now I am ready to draw this line for the total cost by joining these two points and I can draw it all the way across my chart. Finally, I can repeat this process with the revenue. So my revenue, when I sell nothing, I make no money. So one point is the origin of the graph, the zero, zero point. The other points I've placed it up here, so if I have a price of £5 per unit, then when I sell 10,000 units, I'm going to make £50,000. I'm now ready to draw the revenue line on my graph, like this. And the break-even point is the point at which the revenue line and the total cost cross. You need to be able to draw such graphs in your exam, so make sure to practice and I look forward to seeing your uh, work in the classroom.